preparation and desire is going to get you that title. Nothing else. Now, the desire is hugely important. Yes, it is. Listen, but if you haven't prepared to win, then you better get prepared to fail. If you throw two guys into the ring to fight to the death, who wins? Yes, the guy with the biggest desire to win. But what if they both have the desire? The guy who has prepared the best for the battle. The guy who trained harder, who sacrificed more, who wanted it more. That's the guy that wins. He will win every time because he has more in his locker. He can go one more round. He can take one more hit. He can get up one more time. Now, don't get me wrong. He still needs to have the heart to follow through, the guts to make things happen when there seems no chance for anything to happen. But nothing beats preparation mixed with desire. Nothing. Do you know when the baby giraffe is born, the mother giraffe gives birth standing up. So the first thing that happens to a newborn baby giraffe is a huge fall of about two meters. What a way to enter into the world. No loving cuddle, no smiles, just a giant drop. It gets worse. When the poor little baby giraffe shakes off the initial shock and tries to stand up on his four legs, you would think the mother would try to help her little baby. No, not this time. The mother then proceeds to kick the legs out from under this little baby, sending it sprawling back to the ground. Baby tries again and again. The mother kicks the baby's legs out, knocking it to the ground again. This process is repeated over and over until the newborn giraffe is so exhausted it can't even stand. At this point, the mother will kick it again forcing it to get to its feet. Now you're probably thinking this mother is awful or an exception. No, this happens with all newborn baby giraffes. And why? Because the mother is preparing the child to survive predators in the wild. The baby's first lesson within seconds of entering this world is get back on your feet. Be prepared. Now, I'm telling you that in order to reach any level of success in your life, sometimes you're going to have to get to your feet after suffering setbacks. And all the time, you are going to have to be prepared. Now, I wish I could get a mother giraffe out here to kick some of you into gear and teach you a lesson or two in preparation and survival. But I can't. But what I can do is get someone with more power. You, I can leave it up to you. Prepare yourself for success. Prepare to win. If you get knocked down, don't just get up. Get up stronger than before. Get up more determined than before. Have the desire and heart to follow everything through in your life. Leave no stone unturned and complete nothing half-hearted. You don't have half a heart. Give it all your heart, 100% of your strength, courage, and application. Outwork everyone. Anyone says you can't.